Hello, welcome to Flower Juice. My name's John McDonald, and today we're going to create a little bit of a design in these two little pots that I found. And I think these are absolutely beautiful. They seem to be like handmade, and um, I just really like them. They're kind of organic. They would be nice on their own. Like, there's no reason why we couldn't make an arrangement in this one or make an arrangement in this one. But actually, as a pair, I think they create a really interesting dynamic. So we're going to use these just to create a little bit of a display. So the materials I've got are quite simplified. We've got a few yellow callas, I've got some green leucodendron, and we've literally got a little bit of um, grass. Um, I'm not quite sure what variety this is, but it doesn't really matter. It's all about creating just a texture. So what we're going to do is create a few lines first. So basically we want these to kind of speak to each other. So I am going to just put a cut on and this is where you could, you can obviously use the bottom of the vase. That's not a problem, but you can also come in and use um, the edge of the vase as well. Now this one's interesting, it's got a little hole here as well, so there's no reason why we can't use that for some of the flower as well. So we're kind of setting these up so that they really speak to each other. And depending on how we do that cut, it will sit quite nicely onto the edge. I'm going to take off a little bit of this so this will just give us a little bit of a clearer line. Perfect. So we've got interesting angles. I think maybe it might be worth... yeah that's better. So really we're creating a nice shape there. In fact, we can clean this off a little bit more. And same with this one. And even here is just going to give us a bit more definition on these lines. So we've got our two elements, they're nicely placed, and our leucodendron. And now we can look at our grasses and really I think we want to bring them quite low. It seems a little bit of a shame but just using this in this way creates an interesting effect. And that's the beauty with flowers is there's so much diversity in materials and uh, different textures. There's something for everyone, really. So straight away we've started to create a lot more interest. These lines here are just giving the connection between the two containers. And now we have our lilies. So we kind of need to think, do we want to keep them quite short. I really like this colour on top of this vase. I think that works really well. And do we want to have a couple here and nothing there? Or do we want to... We need to, have to actually balance it up and see. So I think what I would like is to have one that's quite open. And that's going to sit in here. Now, for me to get the angle, I want to make it short. So you really actually start to see that against this colour. And now we can look and see where else we would put flowers. I think another one into here facing back the way would be good. Thank you. 
and you can just hold them up and see where you would like them to be. The only thing is these are quite thin, so I'm a bit worried that they're actually not going to be ideal. And this is where you can really just take your time, relax with the flowers and really enjoy just working with the materials. And actually just having that one sitting forward works really well. So I would have this facing straight forward. We've got more of a block of colour, so we've got a balance there where it's not equal. Uh, we've got a balance between our leucodendrons as well and we've got this contrast with texture with the grasses. So a simple arrangement just bringing two containers where we don't lose the containers with what we've done and we just showcase minimal materials to the best advantage. Hope you've enjoyed today's video. If you'd like to keep up to date with all our ideas and inspiration then click here to subscribe and we hope to see you back soon.